one's better. That one's better. We'll have them both though. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. So, check it out, guys. Um, it's essential. We're gonna take you shopping right now. Um, yeah. Which one should I eat first? Probably the pasta, the chicken pasta. So we're gonna take you shopping right now, but it's essential before you go shopping that you fill your body first, right? Because you don't wanna get in there and like start buying random shit that you don't already need. Like my mom always taught me that, so I'm gonna teach you guys that. So eat, eat up first, then shop, then you kinda like, you know, what you get what you actually need to get rather than just get a bunch of random shit because you're hungry at the time. Because I used to, when I, when I used to shop without being full, I go buy like random like bars and candy and I like eat it while I'm shopping and just get, get too much shit. So anyways, get full before you go and shop. That's a tip, I swear, like real tip, I promise, I promise. But we're gonna go, uh, we're gonna go basically get food um, and it's gonna be like a video for you guys. So if you guys are traveling, like um, what kind of food you can get while you're traveling, like you can bring in your hotel, like keep your hotel, because we're gonna stay at a hotel that's probably not gonna have like, um, I mean, I know it's not gonna have, uh, you know, like a kitchen, right? It's not gonna have a big fridge. So. We're gonna get food that like we can bring over there that's like still slightly healthy, but we can still use like and eat and feel good about while we're here on vacation. So if you guys go to Vegas or wherever you go, the hotel, if it doesn't have like a fridge or a kitchen, we're gonna buy that kind of food. And I'll show you guys that when we go and buy some shit. So buy some shit. We're not gonna buy shit because that'd be disgusting if we bought shit. Like I wouldn't eat it. Kevin might eat it, but I won't eat it. So. Lit. These ads is coming out soon, but look, check this out. If you're reading this, like if you could actually read it. It's arm day, but actually today, like I told you guys when we were in the uh, was CPK, whatever it was, um, I'm gonna show you guys some food that you could buy like when you're traveling. Uh, like, you know, maybe short notice food. Maybe you wanna call it short notice food. Maybe you wanna call it like in the hotel room food. But then, I mean, you already know, Chiquita, I told you guys I was the expert, uh, but bananas, first thing, right? Cause this is something that you could you could buy and like you buy at home, you don't put it in the fridge, right? You put it in the cupboard and like sometimes your fruit flies will come fuck it up and then you have fruit flies on your fucking roof and then like you gotta smash them down with like, it might just be me. But anyways, um, bananas, fucking essential, that's dope. Eat them in the morning, I'm gonna eat it tomorrow morning. I might eat every single one of these actually. Kevin, Kevin will be like, bro, are there any more bananas? I'll be like, huh? What? Who are you, who are you? Anyway, so let's keep going. So check this shit out, right? I feel like a big ass kid when I when I get stuff out of here. Cause you remember like you used to go to candy stores and that's how you got the candy? You just eat it. So now it's like, it's not as good as candy, but like, yeah, we'll make it work. Um, Cause if you just eat candy all day, like your blood sugar be all fucked up. So don't do that. Anyways, this is like hands down my favorite dried fruit. All right, so it's, what I'm gonna do is get like a gang of this. Why do they make them, why are they small? So pick whatever like dried fruit you guys like. You can get anything. It's like so different. I just want to. If I just stuck my hand in that, is that bad? I won't do it. They'll be like, they'll be in the comments section, like, what the fuck are you doing, bro? You fucking dickhead. Because that's how they are. But, anyways, get dry fruit. So, I like uh, figs. I like mangoes. Um, apricots are also real good. But just get any one you like. But just don't, you know, not covered in sugar. So, if you guys are not like whatever. This fucking fancy ass uh, grocery store. If you got another one, just try to get one that doesn't have any sugar added to it. You know what I'm saying? All right. So another thing that you guys can get that that I I would eat when I was traveling. Um, they don't have the peanut butter here or like almond butter here, but I'll get almond butter and I get like these like rice cakes. This is like cinnamon toast. Do you think it tastes like cinnamon toast crunch? I don't know. It doesn't. I'll tell you guys right now. It doesn't taste like cinnamon toast crunch at all. Um, but it, you know. It's pretty good. It's still clean, it tastes good. Like don't, whatever you do, look at me in my face right now. Whatever you do, do not buy the unsalted regular version of these. You will hate you, you will you go like this, and you'll just be like, I'm out of here, right? But cinnamon toast is good. You can put a little bit of the almond butter on it because I don't really like peanut butter that much. I'm an almond butter guy. So get that, it's good. <laughs> Are you filming the whole thing? That, okay, I always do that. Anyways, uh, make sure you guys get water too when you travel. That's something that I've noticed when I travel. If I don't get enough water, I feel like shit. Like the first two days, I feel all right. But like the next couple days, I feel like shit. And then when I get home, I feel like shit. I feel like I have to like redo my whole fucking like, excuse my language, my whole like schedule. So make sure you guys get water um, and stay hydrated. I noticed, seriously, seriously, like no BS. I notice when I go on trips, I always seem to like, 
just not forget about it, but like be focused on doing other things that I don't drink enough water, but you need to drink enough water, especially if like you work out, you're doing it consistently. Maybe if you're in Vegas, you're partying, you're drinking alcohol, whatever else you're doing, make sure you're drinking enough water. Otherwise, like you'll feel like tired and low and like lethargic and stuff. So make sure you get water. So we get like, we get the big waters. We'll bring like, like we're here for four days. Probably get like 15 gallons for four days. What do you want to say about it? What do you mean when I, bro, I'm a, I'm a chocolate expert. I'm a chocolate what expert. What are you, Willy Wonka? I'm fucking Willy Wonka. That guy passed away like last week, RIP. Uh, so but anyways, you, well like I'm, I'm a, oh, taking it's, over the throne. yeah, I'm taking over the throne. It's like when you, when you're you, Charlie. when you what? You're Charlie. Char well, yeah, I'm Charlie. He gave me the golden ticket. Now I'm here to share it with you guys, with you guys. So now that, that, that I took over the throne, um, you know, really important thing. No, serious though, I'm not joking though. Um, I do like dark chocolate and I do know. I read a ton of shit about like, you know, kinds of stuff about like science, math, and other equations and stuff in life that uh, it's good for you. So eat it, um, but you want to get like 70% darker or more. Um, that's also what I read in the science mathematician class about dark chocolate. Um, but yeah, no, it kind of gives you like natural energy, makes you feel good. So pick something that's 70% or more, even though I really just want to get the one that's like no chocolate because it tastes better. So, but you can't do that because Willie was like, no, you can't do it. And then since I had a golden ticket, I was like, all right, I won't do it. So let's find one with a golden ticket. Bro, why the, f whoa, I told you not to film this shit, bro. What are you doing? I'm not getting the candy. I'm not getting candy. I already got the mangoes. I told him to get the mangoes. It's good. You don't got to film this anymore. Don't put this in there. You got to put this in there. Just this fun. This is like this is uh this is for my cousin. My cousin's in Vegas. He's a kid. He's a kid. He's a kid. He likes this stuff. He can't eat mangoes and bananas and stuff all the time. He's not. A, come on. What the fuck is he gonna do with his life? He's gotta have some sugar. Like otherwise, like what's hey. life? I mean, he's a big kid, bro. What do you mean? He needs this. He likes to play sports and stuff. Come on, get out. Get out. It's not for me, man. It's not for me. It's for him. It's for him. Come on. Let's go. Party. What do you say? He said we're gonna party. He's got two weeks left here and he's done. I'm gonna give him a hat because he ran to me while we're filming this. So, what color you want? Um, blue, gray, or khaki? Yeah, blue. Blue? Okay. Oh, damn. This is the one. This is the only one. Look, because look, look. The rest of them are like this. Look. The rest of them are this color. Ooh. So, this this is the fanciest one. Sweet. This is literally one of a kind because this was just a sample. Thanks. So, you get this one. Sweet. Thanks, man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's get a photo. All right, so obviously you guys want a little bit of protein. You're gonna need some kind of protein. I mean, this is like, yeah, beef. Look, it's even like paleo, so like if you're a CrossFitter, CrossFit. So uh, technically, uh, that's the one, Ke Kevin, you're gonna, you got, you're gonna clean this out? You gonna clean this out? Yeah, probably. Anyways, I like my beef jerk, so, um, I don't know which one I'm gonna go with. I like it spicy. They don't have spicy, because they only have uh, corny for the C, for the C word. Anyways, tangy orange teriyaki sounds legit. But you need some sort of protein. Um, and if not this, what's like, cause I wanna like, I gotta show love to like, you know, people who don't eat beef like this. What else can they eat? They didn't eat beef. So like the almond butter or the peanut butter on the on that rice cake, it will have protein in it. It won't be as much as like is in this, obviously. Um, but you can just eat more of that. Um, what else? Rice and beans. What? Rice and beans. Yeah, rice and beans, but they can't, they're not gonna cook rice and beans, you know? So the rice cakes will have some protein in it. Um, and uh, the almond butter that we're about to get will have protein too. So this is like, uh, if you like your, your beef jerked. So you like your beef jerked, then get some beef jerky.